hey how is it going so for anybody that comes to ask you where is that in scripture tell me scripture i only use scripture alone that is how i live my life oh yeah then ask them where in scripture does it say that we use white garments when we are worshiping where in scripture does it say that your pastor's wife you go call her mama but you will not call the mother of jesus our blessed mother where in scripture did it say that you are going to pay your pastor to pray for you so that you will see miracles and wonders is that not idolizing sometimes we ask some questions because deep down inside we know that we are just trying to poke holes inside something that is impenetrable the catholic church is the authority don't let anybody lie to you the catholic church does not only use scripture why is that because guess what not every single directive for every situation in life is contained in scripture the catholic church we are standing on a 2000 plus year tradition you understand things occurred afterwards that needed to be addressed so for that reason we have tradition that guides us but who is our physical leader it's not just a pastor that I went to go and say, I'm going to just find a church. I'm going to build my own church. The Kiniko Kiniko Ministry of the Golden Children of God Ministry Answer Prayers, Touch It Garments and You Will Be Healed Ministry Center. The founder of the Catholic Church is Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ gave Peter the keys. Gave him authority. That is why Peter was the first Pope. Did you know that? Peter was the first Pope. We are faithful to the Pope. Our authority is evident we respect that authority we don't go looking for other people we obey our scripture and our tradition so when you hear about an encyclical has been published by the pope right if you see the catechism of the catholic church do you even own the catechism of the catholic church did you know we had a catechism of the catholic church it contains what we believe scriptural references tradition as well don't let people lie to you. Do not be fooled or deceived. Not every single thing is in scripture. However, the Catholic Church is the authority. Nothing, nobody, no opinion, no extra denomination coming out, kiniko, kiniko, will ever change that in a million years until eternity, until the end of time. So if you are a Catholic and you are wondering, I don't know how to defend my faith. People are asking me all these questions. How do I stand up for it? It is high time. It is overdue. Now is the time for you to learn about your faith, for you to know, okay, what are the traditions that we believe in? What are the scriptural references that even are based in the Bible that we can use to stand up for some certain things? But don't sit there and be pulled into one denomination to the other. Ask them who their founder is. Ask these plenty denominations, who is your founder? Oh, Pastor Jenkins, Dr. Junior, John C. Matthew, Apollonia, Apollotus. Their founder is not Jesus. Their founder is not Jesus they have no authority something about the catholic church do you know that the catholic church is universal what does that mean anywhere you go in the universe enter into that catholic church the mass readings uniform whether you are in japan you are in nigeria you are in thailand you are in hawaii you are in belize you are in nicaragua you are in anywhere south africa the mass reading is the same today is whatever today is today is what saturday of the 10th weekend ordinary time go to a church in japan or in nigeria the mass is the same the same readings we don't just go according to oh i feel like reading from matthew 5 17 to 22 open up we have order we have uniformity we have authority why because jesus instituted us not a mere mortal not a man not somebody who is not even ordained Come and say, I am Pastor Greenleaf Jr. Apollonia Okafo. And for that reason, every knee will bow. Hey, praise the Lord. Not everybody that says praise the Lord is praising the Lord because you don't know what they do behind closed doors to get that power. I'm saying all this to enlighten you, to open your mind, to come back home because falling away from the faith and hip hopping and hippity hopping to one church to the other will not save you. Again, not everything is in scripture alone. We don't only use scripture. If anybody wants to combat it, you are combating God. If anybody wants to question the Catholic Church, guess what? You are questioning God. And with all of this said, may God bless you.
abundantly.